Hi, this is Maria from Maddie's Way of Life. Welcome back to my channel. I am a mommy, I am a planner babe, and I am a first grade teacher. Today, I want to do cash envelope stuffing for my wallet as well for my sinking funds. So if you're interested, go ahead and stay tuned. Okay, here we go. This is a happy planner. It is a budget happy planner. It's in the classic size and it's an 18 month planner that started July, 2019. The cover actually looks like that and it does come with this discs. All I did is I, I created this list with my sister for my sinking funds and to figure out the envelope breakdown as well as the cash breakdown. So uh, all I did is I made a copy and measured it to size and I used that. So I'm going to go ahead and get started right now. Our cash budget for this week is $809. Out of these $809, I need to budget for my wallet. So that is my spending money during the week, as well for sinking funds that are things that are coming in the near future that I want to make sure I'm ready for. A couple things are happening and today's date is 9-11-19. And as you may know, if you have seen any of my other videos, let's take a moment because... I did get my nails done and I feel very happy about it. And I am glad for all of your comments. Thank you so much. They pumped me and they made me really reflect on what was important to me. So I, I feel great. And although I didn't budget for it last week, I was very fortunate that my sister actually gave me $20 for supplies that I had purchased with her for her during the summer. So she paid that back and also she gave me a $25 gift card from Walmart so I actually ended up adding an envelope for my wallet and an envelope actually two envelopes for my wallet and I actually did add a sinking fund envelope as well but I'm not going to fund it uh, just ne just yet but let's go ahead and get started because I do not want to do the blah 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 I want to do my breakdown and these are my categories. What I do here is I just put in, this is for my wallet. So I'll just put W. And these are sinking funds. Okay. Now, the most important part, the amount that goes into groceries is $150, family night, $30, gasoline, $150, entertainment, $20, husband spending, $40, my spending, $20, water, $10, and this one for Camila and Sofia, I am going to do $10, babysitter, $120, giving ten dollars and then health and fitness and beauty i am going to skip because i'm hoping that i have enough leftover from last week i won't be rolling over to the next week for some of them so i will go ahead and add to these now for amazon not for amazon now for sinking funds for amazon it is five dollars camila's birthday is 22 dollars car tags are nine dollars costco membership seven dollars Cruise spending, $25. Field trips, $7. Household Me Mexico, $39. Hybrid allowance, $10. Savings, 
Sophia's birthday, $8. Special event, $30. And traveling, $77. Now, the next step is I am going to do the cash breakdown. Okay, here we go. I'm trying to learn from my mistakes. So I tried to do a different color up here so it wouldn't blend in with the color ink from my copy. So I am going to go ahead and do the count of the cash breakdown to see how many bills I need of each. For 100, I need one, two. I can't help it, I want to laugh. One, two. I couldn't believe that I had missed that other number last week. If you watch my video, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. One, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. And then I have 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. I kind of want to double check, but I'm not. Let's see what the denominations are at this point. I have 200, 100, and these are 16 times, okay, 320. And then we have eight bills, so that's 80. And then we have 17 times five, 85. And then we have 24. Let's see what that amount is. We have $24 plus 85 plus 80 plus 320 plus 100 plus 200 equals $809. Oh my goodness. I am shocked. Okay, now let's see if that's what happened here. It should be since this matches perfectly, but just double checking. 150 plus 30 plus 150 plus 20 plus 40 plus 20 plus 10, 20. I 120, that's 40. Plus 140 plus 10 plus 5 plus 22 plus 9, plus 7, plus 25, plus 7, plus 39, plus 20, plus, oh sorry, plus 8, plus 30, plus 77, equals 809. Oh my goodness. Look at me being successful today. Okay, that is awesome. Now that I have that, let me go get the cash. Okay, so this is the paper that my husband took to the bank. It is laminated and my sister and I created this as well. I hope the glare is not messing it up, but this is the paper that he did take. And it's supposed to be 809, but he did take his money. So his spending money is $40, so it will no longer be here. I am going to go ahead and fix these denominations because I thought they had given it an order and they're not. So I am going to fix the bills. Give me one sec.
Okay, let's get this done. I just took this out of my cash wallet and I am very excited. I am very pleased with the envelopes and I'm always excited to stuff my envelopes because um i ran out of some already so i need to make sure i have some money in my wallet let's check out groceries and for groceries uh i have 40 dollars left i don't know how this happened i don't know i don't know how this happened but we have 40 dollars and if it's purple if i ran a line through it it means that i've already put it in my budget planner so that means i don't have to worry about inputting these transactions so forty dollars i'm going to leave them to the sign and putting this back in here but i am going to put in 150 for this week so that's 150 dollars and they go in here so that we have our grocery money then family night for family night uh, we had some left as well it was the weirdest thing this week we had twenty dollars and these are going to go on this for on the side for now until we figure out what we're going to do some of them like i said will roll over these i don't think i am so for family night it is thirty dollars this week i am going to do five ones one two three four and one more is five and then i am going to do one denomination of five and two of ten one and two here we go one <laughs> here we go 10 20 25 26 27 28 29 30 and 30 will go here in family night. All right, good. Awesome. Gasoline is going to get $150. And I think this time around, I did six bills of 20 and six bills of five. But we do have leftover in here. And honestly, I wanted to keep it in here just because... I, I thought about, oh, so this is for, I need to get a new one. I thought about letting roll over just in case we have something to do additionally on a weekend that we need gas for. But honestly, if I need money for gas, then that means I need to budget for some kind of traveling. So in any case that that would happen, then I would just go ahead and budget the whole trip, not just gasoline. So, I mean, it's kind of nice to have some cushion in here, but I think I'd rather... Put it elsewhere this time around okay so i'm gonna put that to the side and then we need another one of these so i'll just put that one away and i'll bring in a new one for this one i i actually created this one myself and i just added one additional line for category because when i was writing them in my budget journal i was like which card is for what so this one is for gasoline i'm just going to go ahead and put that category And I'm going to put it right in here as well with the denominations of 620s. One, two, three, four, five. One more. Six. And remember, this one gets 150. So now I need six fives. One, two, three, four, five and one more if it wants to come with me it doesn't there we go six so there we go let's count this money out 20 40 wow let's do this one more time 20 40 well this one is really old it doesn't want to slide oh my goodness 20 40 60 80 100 120 125 30 35 40 45 and 50 so that is a total of 150 for gasoline moving on to entertainment and entertainment 
I think I'm gonna roll over this one. For entertainment, we have a cup of money left in here. So I am going to add $20 if I'm not mistaken. Let me just look at my cheat sheet on the sign. I don't remember. Yeah, it is $20 and the denomination will be just 120. So then this will now make this 20, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48. Deposit 911. Deposit 20. And now, did I say 48? We really have 48 in here? Oh yeah, we do. 40, 45, 46, 47, 48. And I just wanted to roll over just in case we want to do movies soon. $48. Now, the one thing I forgot to do is put in the deposit amount on these. So I am going to go back. And once I have like all of the, once I have all the specific steps for what I do, I, I, I will be better at this. And I'm totally sorry. Like, I forget like some steps and then later on I'm like, oh my gosh, I never put in that I deposited money. But you know what? It's a learning experience and it's okay. Don't be intimidated or overwhelmed. Just get started because you're going to make mistakes. Believe me, you are. And it's totally okay because we learn from them. So here we added $150 and we have $150. I'm glad I remember now because then I am getting ready to do a transaction. I'm like, wait, out of what amount? So deposit, what is this? Family night, we did 30 plus 30. And we actually are going to do, oh, that is horrible. $30 because we took out the 20 that were in here. And then, last but not least, to take out my card again, is groceries. In groceries, we are taking the leftovers out and we only are leaving the deposit in of 150. Okay, now let's go back and continue on. Okay, did I do entertainment? I did. Spending. Did I do entertainment? Okay, so spending for me, my husband already got his. I don't have anything in here because I ended up using $10 I had left over for my nails and then with the additional 20 that my sister gave me, that was awesome. And that's why this Envelope is depleted, and we're going to go ahead and deposit. I believe it's 20. I hope I'm not mistaken. And I think that the nomination is 20 as well. Yes. So that's one bill of 20, and it's going in here. For water, it is $10, and I think this time around, I did two fives. So let me see if there's anything in here. Whoops. We do have $3, and I wanna say I wanna leave them in here, but maybe not. We'll take them out, and then we add 10, 5, 10. Alrighty, we have 10. This week, it's not going to be trouble. Are you water envelope? Okay, it is in. 
and accounted for. Okay, Camila and Sofia. So let me tell you why I changed this from Taekwondo to Camila and Sofia. Camila um, is participating in an 100 mile club membership, which means she has to run 100 miles during the course of the school year at school. And to be part of the club or earn special gifts while she hits certain milestones, it is $10 membership. And that's something I do in my classroom as well. By the way, I've been blogging. Well, actually I vlogged on Monday and then I had parent volunteer in there. So it was kind of a little hard, but I will finish my vlog tomorrow and then I will be uploading tomorrow as well. So hopefully that goes up. Anyway, I'm saying that only to say I took the $10 that were in here and I paid for a hundred mile and I figured, you know what? I need a spending envelope because pictures are coming up as well. I just need to keep it here for now until I can get a solid sinking fund for that. So in here, she only had left $3 and I am, I'm having that rollover because we never know. And I know she has board breaking this week. We're adding a denomination of 10 only. And I know that's going to be gone by Friday. 9-11 deposit, $10. That's a total of $10 in this envelope. So, oh, there we go. Babysitter gets 120. Goodbye, 100. And 20. And I do not have an envelope for this. Well, actually, I made an envelope. You know why? Because I wanted to keep track in my... I wanted to keep track in my budget planner since I was trying to figure out monthly expenses. And so deposit. And just basically for dates more than anything. I'm telling you by tomorrow morning, half of my cash envelopes will be depleted. Okay, so babysitter. Then giving, I think I get, yes, everything is gone. So we're just going to deposit plus 10. And it's going to be a total of 10, and today is 9 11. And I will get what denominations did I do for giving? I think I just did 110. And last time I ended up giving it to one person completely, and I think I'll do the same thing this time around. Okay. Health and fitness is not getting anything from my actual husband's paycheck this week, but I do want to put something in health and fitness and in beauty. And I think I am going to use out of this money right here. I haven't been recording when I have additional funds, so that kind of scares me because, I mean, it's expected that I did budget for this and now it's extra. Let's see how much I had this week. I have, and I didn't even take some from there. 20, 40, <clears throat> 60, 70, 75, 80, 81, 82, 83. Now, this is a lot of money. I don't know how that happened. But what I want to do is put this in household, no, personal care, because there are some expenses that need to happen this week. So this will go for personal care right here. I'm gonna put it to the side. And then <clears throat> these right here, this one right here will go 25, will be for, I want to put it in the gift category, but I'm not. I mean, I'm still going to record it under the gift sinking fund category, but these $25 are going to go for a birthday that is happening tomorrow. And of course, notorious for not remembering birthdays. And I want to make sure I treat this person at work. So she's one of our um, staff members there on campus. So I want to make sure she gets treated. I am actually collaborating with other three girls to get her in a $100 card for a massage place. So that shall be fun for her and she deserves every bit of it. So this is going to go to the side for sinking funds. That's perfect. I'm glad I had leftover. Then here I am just going to, for health and fitness, I want to do something. I don't know what, because I need new workout pants. So I think I'll do 10. 
I'll put them in here. 10 right here. This one is a recycle card, so 9-11, deposit, $10, and a balance of $10, okay. And this is for health and fitness. And then for beauty, which is my nails, I am going to add 9-11, and this is rolling over, deposit of five, six, seven, eight, eight dollars plus eight and now we have five six seven eight nine ten so we have a total whoops of ten dollars in here really did i say that right five six seven eight nine ten it is ten that's awesome okay so now it's a total of ten dollars perfection oh my goodness so this is all done i am excited that they are all filled right now so i am going to go ahead and put it back in my wallet and i am a happy happy camper they go back in here there we go all done okay that is done now for the next part i am going to go ahead and do my sinking funds i'm really excited about this so for amazon prime we always start with amazon prime and these are like the most important envelopes that I think should be fulfilled. Give me one sec. All right, let's do this. This is exciting. Now, this right here are Amazon envelopes. All of them are Amazon envelopes. The discs are two discs, and I will link everything down below. And then all I did was cut cardstock to size and then hole punch it with the Happy Planner. A hole puncher and I just put them together so I did use double-sided tape to attach these two together and they're working out nicely I really like how organized they stay and I'm not losing them or they're not slipping off so I love them especially because I'm crazy and I have too many but it's okay it works out it works for me and whatever works for you just do it go for it all right and so Amazon Prime gets five dollars and I'm excited about this. And if you didn't hear last week, I had my husband help me. I have a different sheet. So let me show you that before I go anywhere. This sheet right here, I don't feel loud until it is Saturday or Sunday when my husband is here. And we did this together as well as filling the individual sinking fund. This one obviously doesn't have anything, but for example, this right here. So if there was a sinking fund that was funded, then he helps me count. He actually counts all the money and I do the writing in my planner. So that's what we do on the weekend. And that's awesome. We have found that it is bringing us together in one same mentality for saving and one same purpose to make sure we are financially secure if to call it something and i am feeling really good about it and in the front i do have i want to also mention a savings goal of one thousand dollars and i am not really attacking it right now but i am putting a little bit of time and today i think it's going to be at fifty dollars so i'm excited to highlight this part so i'll come back to this in a little bit but anyway that's what i use and i created that form as well not the little jar the jar is from Mambi, the actual planner. So, Amazon Prime. Moving on. <laughs> Amazon Prime is five buckaroonies. <laughs> I'm excited about this. I like counting this. Guys, do you like counting this? Oh, my gosh. F uh, five. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Oh, my goodness. I'm so excited. I, I can't. I can't. I still can't get over the fact that... 
four dollars at a time five dollars at a time two dollars at a time make a difference it they it really does so i'm excited i'm so excited anniversary is not getting anything appliances is not getting anything back to school is not getting anything but camila's birthday it's getting something so this one is for 22 dollars i'm gonna take what's in here put it to the side and i'm gonna grab 22 dollars because i am attempting not to make as many mistakes today because you know I will, I will, and it's okay. I'm okay with that. All right, that's $22, 20, 21, 22. Let's bring this in. Oh my goodness, that's an $100 bill right there. Whew. Let's count this, guys. Okay, 120, 140, 150, 151, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56. She has $156. Yay! I am excited. Be excited for me. Please be excited for me. Car insurance is not getting anything at this time. Car maintenance, not getting anything at this time. I think it's funded for an oil change right now, so I don't want to attack it fully right now. Car tax is getting something this time around. Did I skip one? I feel like... You know what? I think I did it incorrectly. Okay, never mind. Okay, let's go back to this. Car tax. Car tax is getting nine dollars. We're gonna pull this out and we're going to grab five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Let's put it in here. And let's do the best part. 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54. Oh my goodness. This is unbelievable. I really, I mean, I can't, I have no words. Cell phone, not getting anything. Christmas, not getting anything. Classroom. I should really put into classroom. Oh my goodness, yes. Clothing is not getting anything. Costco membership. Costco membership mm, is getting something. So let's take this out, put it on the side, and Costco is getting $7. So five, six, and nine. Let's do seven. So let's go and put this to the side. And we're gonna do this one here. Let's see how much does this have? 10, 20. Let's do it this way. 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42. Hi, baby. Ooh, I like that dragon. $42 for Costco membership. I love it. Okay, I am back. I had to step out for a little bit. Cruise spending is getting something, and I think it's $25. If I'm not mistaken, I'm pulling this out, and I'm getting 20 25 and let's fix this in here. 20. Twenty five in there. So that's 100, 120, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 91, 92. 
It is so close. I kind of want to grab from somewhere else to have the 200. But we're good. We're good. I'm going to be good. And I'm excited about that. Okay. Date night is not getting anything right now. Family giving is not getting anything right now. Field trips is getting $7. So let's see how much we have. Five. Six. Seven. There we go. We're going to put five in there. And put this one in here. Let's see. 20. Oh, did I put this one in the wrong place? Yes. 20. 25. 30. 35. 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42. Oh my goodness. So pumped about this. $42. And when the date comes, I won't be struggling to try and pay it out of a credit card or something like that. So that is done. Gifts is not getting anything this week. Health is not getting anything this week. This is a new one, health and fitness. Um, what else? This one is home maintenance, is not getting anything right now. Household, this is the one, remember that extra money on the side? I want to add 40 to this fund right here. And so, it, oh, okay. Oh, never mind, it's not household, it's personal care. Personal care, I apologize. Moving this back to where it was. Okay, household Mexico is getting something this week and household Mexico is getting $39. So let's take this out. 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. Oh my gosh, look at the difference. I love because you can maneuver them so much easier when they're brand new. Okay. 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. We're adding it to this fund right here. That's a 20. There is no 10 yet. So now we have the first 10, then five, then the rest are ones. Okay. So we have 50, we have 70, 90, 100 oh my goodness 100 right here 105 110 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 117 dollars for household mexico hybrid allowance gets ten dollars this week because we had leftovers last week so i didn't want to mess with this we don't need this anymore so 25 yeah we had is this this is the wrong envelope oh my goodness okay here's hybrid allowance hybrid allowance had leftover so i decided to do only 10 this time and for hybrid allowance i did a denomination of 10 just because she has a lot of change and that way i can help her change it because she does have savings as well so i will do a denomination of 10 so that will bring it to 20 30 35 for savings we are doing 10 so we're skipping this one this one oh we're not skipping personal care here it is i saved the receipt in there I am putting 40 in here, like so, because we need stuff, like I said, and this is from the leftover money from my wallet, and then we're heading straight to savings. Like I said, savings is $10 this week, which now brings the amount to 50 buckaroonies. Oh my gosh, $50, guys. We reached our first goal as of $50, I need to fix this envelope because it's kind of falling apart there. 
So we reached $50. I'm gonna bring it out real quick because I think it's exciting. And I will use, let's use purple. $50. Okay, so now that that is done, let me fix this again. All right, moving on. Uh, this is a new one, school for Camila, and that way I can get some funds in here just for like school pictures, for like 100 mile stuff, and I don't know, there was something else that I was thinking about that I said I should have at least, I don't know, 20, 30 bucks in here. So that's something that I wanna fund as a sinking fund. Then Sophia's birthday, we're going to add $8. That's five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, this one definitely needs to have different denominations because it's getting a little full. There's five, and there are my dollars. Okay, let's count. 10, 20, 30, 40. 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46. 47, 48. All right. All right, Sophia. If she would just go to sleep right now, that would be awesome. 48. <laughs> Sophia's birthday. And then for special event, I am going to add $30. I'm taking this out right now. And I will be adding 20 and 30. And I will be adding them over here. And is there a 10? Okay, there we go. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, and 90. All right. For Taekwondo, we're not funding. And for travel, we are. For travel is getting 77, 50, 70, 75, 76, 77. Oh my goodness, you don't know what a relief it is to get to this point and actually have the right denominations for everything. So let's go ahead and pull out what's in here. And then just place this in to the right spot. And no, they're not facing the same way, but I'm okay with that once they're in the right envelope. Okay, let's count. 50, 100, 150, 150, 70, 90, 210, 220, 25, 30, 230, 231, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 236 dollars. Whoop, whoop. All right, this is exciting. And Christmas at work is not getting anything at this moment in time. There's just one thing that I need to go back to, and that is the envelope for gifts. And, oh, there it is. For gifts, I don't think we have any. Oh, we do. I'm lying. Okay. We don't need this any longer. But I will add 25 to this one because... I need to fund that gift. So it's going in here briefly just so that I can document all of this in my budget planner. But after that, I will take it out, put it in my wallet, and then I want to help out with that one gift that I told you in the beginning of the video. So now this is all 
done oh my gosh they're all done and it's very exciting to feel that to feel so accomplished right now there is one thing that i want to add one special envelope and now this one came out one special envelope that i want to add and i want to see if i have an extra one of these but i don't think i do ahorita voy mi amor okay can you wait okay thank you baby um let me see you know what then it will be a special one how about that i still have an extra one from these envelopes I, although i did not want to use these i am going oh they're too long they're a little bit too long never mind i won't use this one let's see what about these envelopes that i'm not using right now Okay, this might work. Let's use this one right here. And I'm gonna make a label for this one. But right now, what is going to happen, see, I actually have these pre-cut just in case I need to add one. This is just cardstock. I'm going to get one of these double-sided tape and this is all i do i seriously just put i don't know if you can really see that double-sided tape like that and i kind of just go like this like so and that's it and then i add it in here it's going right after christmas at work going right here so it's the last one actually and this one right here until i can get more envelopes i thought i had an extra one of the yellow ones but for now that's what it is and this one is going to be called youtube and i want to start putting in here because i've waited so long to get at least a little bit closer to my a thousand subscribers and I have faith that it's going to happen soon. So I am going to change this label and I'm gonna call it YouTube. And I want to go ahead and put money for my giveaway. And I already know, since I've known this forever, what I want to do. And I want to, I love Amazon. So I want to give you back for all of the support that you give me so i want to give you amazon gift card and i think i am going to do three gift cards when i get there um i want to do 20 dollar gift cards for each person that wins and that will be as soon as i hit my a thousand subscribers and i could only it could only get better it could only get better i am very excited and i know i rarely mention that in my videos because I truly I was actually even afraid to do this video today just because I wanted to make sure I did it well and I wasn't tired but guess what that's never going to happen because right now I know I have to go and read a story to my daughter I've been do I've been at work I'm a first grade teacher as you know and I've been at work for 10 hours I'm not supposed to be there for 10 hours but you know my heart tells me that I do that I have to. And so anyway, that's what this envelope is going to be. For now, it's just going to be this one right now. But I really want to thank you guys for all of your support. And if you like this video, like always, please press the thumbs up. Go ahead and comment below if you have any questions. I would try to link everything that I use down below. And this is, do you see, that was super easy. I mean, the time consuming part is cutting the strips down. But honestly, it's all worth it. Like once you have it together, it's so well organized. I mean, there is no, I mean, you can flip it any way you want it and it'll still be okay. So I really enjoy being here with you guys. Thank you so much for all the new subscribers. I appreciate each and every single one of you. And if you're new to my channel, please go ahead and consider subscribing. I love you guys. Take care. But more than anything, God bless. Bye.